Ashton Kutcher parties in Brazil as Demi Moore checks into hospital. Towie's Lydia Bright left in tears while filming the fourth series of the reality show. Simon Cowell wants to give Cheryl Cole a job. All that and more on today's Celebrity News Beats. While ex-wife Demi Moore was being rushed to hospital in Los Angeles, estranged husband Ashton Kutcher was partying in Brazil. The emergency services dashed to Demi's home following concerns about her health. The Hollywood star was assessed by paramedics for more than half an hour at her Los Angeles home before being taken to a local hospital. Although it's not known exactly why the 49-year-old was admitted to hospital, it's safe to say Ashton was entirely none the wiser as he messed about in Sao Paulo. Filming for the fourth series of The Only Way is Essex is well underway and we've managed to get some sneaky snaps of the cast including some pictures of some fresh new faces. But a tearful Lydia Rose Bright looks anything but a happy bunny while filming some of the first scenes for the new series. Apparently the cause of her upset was something to do with boyfriend James Argent. Lydia sought comfort in fellow star Lucy Mecklenburg while Lydia's mum Debbie hung out with leading Essex lady Lauren Goodger. Ever since Simon Cowell asked Cheryl Cole from US X Factor, relations between the pair have been a little bit frosty, but the music mogul has now confirmed they are friends, and in fact he wants to give her a job. Simon has revealed her X Factor axe is now a thing of the past, telling the son that she understands that in their business when something happens, it usually happens publicly but he would give the 28-year-old back her seat on the X Factor panel if she wanted to return. Daniel Radcliffe looks happy as he attends the Woman in Black UK premiere in London. A pretty Miranda Kerr arrives in Tokyo. Catherine Heigl looks red hot at the New York premiere of her latest film, One for the Money. And finally, singer Taylor Swift has braved the cold, heading to London where she is said to be in rehearsals for the upcoming Les Miserables film. But before getting down to work, the 22-year-old country music star took time out to visit the Princess Diana Memorial Fountain at Hyde Park. Earlier in the day, she also managed to fit in a little bit of shopping and it turned oh so sweet when she headed to Chocolatier, Charbonnelle Walker on Bond Street.